Hi. <laughs>I think I'm back for my spackle. I've done this intro like five different times for like different events and stuff that I was going to and just never actually ended up filming everything which was shit. So I think for this intro because I am officially back I am officially going to do this video because I'm going home to Ireland for the first time since um, I've stopped and obviously who doesn't love an, Ir an Ireland vlog? Um, so yeah. I'm not going to go into the world's longest detail about why I took so long to come back because it's irrelevant. Irrelevant in the life that is now. I'll just like run through it. Basically, I'm living my hot girl summer. I'm healthy. I'm single. I'm happy. Everything is A-OK. -okay. It just took a bit of time to reevaluate my life and come back. But I'm back everything is fine I am happy I am healthy like I said everything is good everything is great we're 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 fine we're thriving in life so that's just as deep so I'm gonna go into it um because we don't want any Debbie Downers on this video no 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 thank you not cute so basically hi how are we all doing I have actually missed you so much and I feel kind of shit that I didn't post for so long and like every time I kept doing it and then like my friends would be like why are you not posting like where are YouTube videos which actually like made my heart be like <laughs> that's really cute cute because like you don't think that much about it until like obviously you stop and then people are like why are you not posting so that's always fun and we're going home my brother and I Aiden I think he's Aiden's been on a few vlogs um but I don't think he's been the main character, so I think I'll allow him to have his main character moment in this one. We're going home just for a long weekend um, to see the family. My friends are coming home from Dubai and Australia. Um, so this is going to be the first time that we're all home in like three years or something, all at the same time, which is going to be so fun. I'm um, going to brunch with the girls. Like, it's just going to be a really wholesome weekend. And I think it's definitely needed after the last couple of months. Um, I haven't been home since February, I don't think. Um, so, that's a long time. It's July now. It's nice to go home and, like, stand on, like, Irish soil and stuff. I think it just kind of resets my whole chakra and makes me feel better. I don't know if that sounds silly or not, but it's just, it helps. And I think it's just going to really set me off well for the summer uh, even though the weather is so freaking weird here in london like it's a boiling hot one minute like i have tan lines this is natural tan from like the last two weeks and then this whole week like i packed away my summer or my winter stuff and had to pull it all out so that's just like really depressing and i don't even want to talk about that but yes i'm currently waiting for aiden to come we have to get the train to gatwick we're flying we're flying to belfast because that's where my mother is and then we're driving down to Carlo on tomorrow Friday um, and I'm finally getting my license sorted I say I've said this in so many videos but it's been over a year since I lost my license in LA last summer and I still haven't gone to get it sorted so that's we're doing that tomorrow which is exciting I'll finally be able to drive even though I don't have a car but you know if, if the instant comes up I'm not I, I mean I still wouldn't because I'd probably murder somebody because I haven't driven in so long but I'll drive when I go home, maybe. <laughs> if I'm sober for 10 minutes that I can drive around, I'll drive and we can go on a sing song. That would be so much fun. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna finish getting ready. I'm packed and everything. I'm basically ready to go. It looks like it's gonna rain. Goop, that's not really cute, but oh, let's just hope it doesn't, okay? Cause I'm not bringing an umbrella. We've left. Or Aiden's carrying my bag because it's too heavy. And then I'm carrying his bag because I don't need, what, what did you even pack? Shorts. It's like raining in 19 degrees. Oh well. Any home, but I obviously had to bring eight. Ugh, eight Is that changes. My I didn't know that she got your hair cut. Did you cut your beard? Yeah. yeah. Your beard looks nice. Thank you. Any home, back to me now. I had to bring like eight changes of outfits because obviously I never know what I'm doing, whereas men seem to not care. This is true. We don't care at all. This wind is giving me a main character moment. Fuck off, Rapunzel. We made it to a wetter spoon, so I'm awkwardly vlogging. Hi. <laughs> Public. Well, I've got my taco bar. 
actually have the glasses here as well. We don't have the glasses. If you didn't know, my brother works at Witherspoon. <laughs> he is Mr. Witherspoon and hasn't shut the fuck up a lot since we got in here. Yeah. So. So far, I'm having the best time ever. Those two did four crosses. They went out there and just knocked down the whole big lady. My brother has this thing where he has an Irish accent, but puts on an English accent, so we'll start a sentence in Irish and end it in English. Only oh, he ends it in English, I don't answer because it's honestly infuriating and I can't really deal with it. But either way, we're free to talk. What do you want me to do about it? Talk normally. I am talking normally, it goes in and out, like, what the fuck do you want me to do? See? So Irish, that was beautiful, <laughs> that was lovely. I'm a turtle. Yeah. So guys, let me know in the comment section. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. With the state of me, if you know me, you'll know that like I cry over like the slightest inconveniences in my life. But I think I have a God-given right to cry this time. Basically, obviously, I'm still in my room. Well, I'm back in my room. We got on the flight, sat on the plane for two and a half hours, like delayed, delayed, delayed. And then he was like, something's wrong with the plane. We have to get you a new plane. And this went on for ages and basically just cancelled our flight. So um, they booked us on a flight, but me and Aiden's phones were both dying. Couldn't book a flight, so all the early flights are gone. So we don't get to fly out till um, six o'clock tomorrow evening or something. So that's shit. We obviously lose a whole day um, going home. Uh, so I had a little cry. It's totally fine. It's allowed, I think. I'm allowing myself to have a cry. Um, but yeah, it's look. It could be worse, you know, I could have taken off and the plane could have exploded and then you never would have seen this vlog and life would be very sad. <sighs> so it's fine, but I'm going to sleep now. At least I get to have a lie in tomorrow. Silver linings and stuff, but um, yeah, just a bit of a disappointing day and a long ass day and oh, I'll get to do it all again tomorrow. But tomorrow was like really warm or something. See, today wasn't too warm, whereas tomorrow was like 27 degrees or something, so... Travelling in that kind of heat is going to make me <laughs> not very nice. Stay tuned for more tears because I'm sure they're going to go. Morning. I've stopped crying. Oh. <laughs> I've stopped crying. I've had my sleep. My face is extremely swollen. I don't know if that's because I actually did make it onto an airplane yesterday. Even though it didn't take off. I think those gases mess up your face. So, it's fine. It's Friday morning. All is fine. I'm I actually have a really sore knee, whatever the hell that's about. But, look. Hopefully, fingers crossed. And I mean fingers crossed. We'll be in Ireland by this evening. I had dinner plans this evening with the girls. But, unfortunately, obviously, I'm not going to be there. But it's fine. We'll all see them all tomorrow. And everything is fine. I'm gonna eat my shreddies now and lie out in the sun and pretend that I am um, fine. Let's try this shit again in a hundred degree heat. At least I found this strapped Connor's bag, which I didn't have yesterday, so I broke my arm. But we move. At least we know At this the one works. Again, still cold, but I have pins today, so I'm less upset. They've delayed our flight by two hours. One hour. One hour and a half now. They've given us half an hour back. Our plane was in Venice, or is in Venice? At least we know this one works. Ugh. Do you know who's not in Venice? Me. But I didn't have it yesterday, and I was like, I didn't know if you'd actually She's done it. She's just vlogging the whole experience. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, nice houses. Good morning, Baltimore. That was stunning, wasn't it? Good morning, everybody. How are we? So, finally made it last night, as you saw. I'm actually just putting you in the press now because we, I haven't, I have nothing to put you on. Pretty. We made it to Belfast. Thank God. After being delayed again, but sure, look, silver linings were here. That's very loud. 
Um, so just getting ready now to go to Burris. It's like half eight or something in the morning, but I'm going to brunch today with Sally and Maria um, in Kilkenny. So got to be there like ASAP Rocky. I'm going to have to do my makeup in the car because like traveling girl vibes, nobody panic. This is not what I'm wearing, by the way. I'm just wearing it to travel. But yeah, super fun filled day. Look at this. Look at my little Carlos mug. Do you remember that, guys? Remember we went there together? <sighs> okay, I'm losing my shit. I need a coffee. See you in the cupboard. I'm gonna get ready. You're right. You're organised and ready, and I'm not. Um, well, whose fault is that? We finally made it in the car. We're late because some people didn't know how to get ready on time. Those are you two because I was ready before everybody. Oh, shit. I was ready, was dancing we to Taylor Swift. We were gonna leave at nine. Please leaving stop. But I'm early because I was early because like I was dancing around. to Taylor Swift. Yeah, ignore me. Stop talking. Oh, that ear's lovely. So now we're just leaving Belfast and it's 10 really to 9. Belfast. We're meant to be in Kilkenny for one. Ow, and I have a toothache, I think. That's not a good start. My teeth look really white. Why do you need to away if we get there by like It's three hours if I don't stop. Good hey, morning, mommy. Good morning, mommy. That's all is here. We don't need anybody else's opinion on it. All is well. We're, I'm late already for brunch, so that's completely fine. Um, I'm, it's giving school uniform, but I don't really care. She looks cute. It's cute, it's cute, it's fine. It's actually a lovely day. Oh, that wind punched me in the face, didn't it? But no, I'm super excited. Yeah, I haven't eaten, like, I had an apple and some cheese there with my nanny because she's adorable and she loves me. But I'm Not like, chef. my stomach's eating itself, so. Come on, I haven't eaten anything. Step on it, woman. Doing my best. I'm definitely gonna get um, given out two pound hairstyles in the background, but whatever. Hello. <laughs> I'm mildly drunk. Walking down the town that I grew up in, which is like very not like blogger friendly. I don't even know if this is looking at me, but I'm being like, I'm extremely socially unaware. No, socially aware. Unaware? I don't know, but it's kind of stressing me out, and like, I haven't even got my thing flipped up. I don't know why this town does this to me. It makes you feel very self-conscious about your life. But anyhow, I'm walking down now. I really have to pee. Like, really have to pee. <laughs> I don't know why I'm not talking. It's like, you're gonna... No, I'm mildly drunk as well, so nobody panic. <laughs> Morning. I feel like an absolute bag of shit. It's also enough family time. I actually hate everybody, so I'm ready to go home now. I have to travel by myself home today. I'm actually not that bad, I just, we're going to get dinner with my nanny and granddad now, which I need, because I need food and then I'll be fine. But yeah, I'm feeling a little bit rough today. My flight's not until 9 o'clock tonight as well, which is so freaking long, but hopefully it's not delayed or anything, otherwise I will cry. So, yeah. Stay tuned for that. Hello. It's like a week since I've, no, it's not a week since I've come home. It's nearly a week though. No, it's nearly a week since I left. It's a week since I left. Oh, sorry, I'm talking, I'm too shy. But um, I'm gonna obviously finish the vlog here. I made it home in one piece, thank God. Um, it was lovely to be home. I'm happy to be home here now. Um, I've actually just come off a job interview, which is crazy. Made it to the final round of this job interview, which is great because I just need to get out of my current job. The money is less, but for my sanity, we gotta go. So that's exciting. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna post next. I don't know really what the vibe is with this, but I'm glad that I posted and vlogged my trip home as like my start back. I think that's a vibe. But um, I just wanted to say thanks for watching. I love you all. I am back. I just don't know how often I'll be back, but I go to Italy to see Eva in two weeks. So I'm definitely gonna vlog that. So that's gonna be absolutely insane. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys then maybe, if not before, but I love you. I missed you. I hope you miss me too. Okay, bye.